Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 53 here in the frozen rock. <coughs> and, uh, and first off, let me apologize ahead of time. Uh, I've been fighting a little bit of a cold this week, so you might hear a cough or two along the way. Uh, I got my water with me, so hopefully uh, I'm going to be able to make it through without too much of a problem. But you might hear it my voice a little bit as well. And with that, there's a drink of water to get going. All right, so, 50, day 52, we finished up the washroom, and I just was sit, I'm just sitting here lounging around on the couch. So let me hop up here, and uh, let's take a look. So we finished the washroom. We got the showers on this side and the toilet facilities on this side. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, so it is done. Pretty basic facility. Let's close that. Now over here on this side. <coughs> mm, we'll see how it goes. This is uh, not good. little water try to <clears throat> keep the tickle out of the throat all right so this is the sleeping quarters we want to finish this today so as you can see <clears throat> I need to finish uh, clearing out the ceiling and get the ceiling in and then I can put all the beds and fixtures and whatnot lockers and that sort of thing over here and if we get this done then it's time to start on the kitchen so once I have an update, and I'm a little farther along here in the uh, sleeping quarters, I'll uh, catch back up with you all. Alright, just to give you a little bit of an update, uh, I also went and got a throat lossage, so hopefully that's going to help somewhat with the uh, uh, throat drying out cracking and all of that sort of good stuff. So I've got the ceiling carved out mostly. <clears throat> As you can see I've got uh, <coughs> scaffolding all laid out here on the bottom. So what I'm going to do is uh, let's see how this looks. I can start putting the ceiling in and that looks like I've got I've got the rock drilled out pretty well I don't see any of it hanging down below and we can put that there there and nope there there <clears throat> Uh, let's get along this wall over here. There we go. Also, with the scaffolding on the floor that I put up, I'll be able to reach all of the ceiling uh, blocks and be able to get those all welded. Alright, let's see. There's that, that one, that one. That one. Uh, I think I got them all. All right, let's yeah. And that's gonna look pretty good. So I got a few cement blocks on me. I can start welding these up. So once I get these all <clears throat> welded up, I will take out the. Uh, Uh, scaffolding on the floor and there we go all right so next time next time I catch back up with you here uh, I should have the ceiling all in and the scaffolding on the floor out so <coughs> I will uh, see you in just a little bit Okay, I think I am just about ready to finish up the ceiling here. 
Let's uh, get these last couple of blocks in place. And then we can uh, take out the scaffolding below. Uh, actually, do I want to take out the scaffolding? No, I don't want to take the scaffolding out just yet. Uh, I need to put my lights in. So, let's go grab stuff that uh, I can get my lights and my co-pilot has just gotten up here uh, so hopefully she's not going to step onto the laptop which she just did and she's now why don't you hop down come on hop down well, she's not going to hop down yet all right well, she'll just have to hang out and slap me in the face with her tail while she's standing here on the table that doesn't have room for anything. There she goes. All right. All right, we're off to go get lights so that we can put some lights in up there. Uh, I think that just takes light bulbs and con uh, construction components. So we'll put those lights in and then we can tear out those uh, those and then we can tear out that scaffolding and then we should be able to start placing everything into place. Uh, let's see, uh, light bulbs, uh, construction components and let's just see what it, I think it's going to be about eight lights that I want to put in down there. And let's see what... Uh, six. One and one. Oh yeah, so we got plenty on us to do those lights. Alright, let's, let's get back down there and... Uh, grab... Put those lights in place. I think I want to put eight in. I think that's what I want to... No. Uh, well, we'll see. It's either going to be eight or six. And... Back down to here. Uh, back up. So I got... One, two, three, four five six so if we put one there and one there on the inside and let's see how this is gonna look no you couldn't just jump down on the other side no, you had to walk in front of me. All right. Uh, control three, four. All right. And. All right. Let's see. <coughs> All right. So if we put one there. Like that. And then we put one over here. Like that. That should do it. And then if we go... Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. We got one, two, three, five, six, seven. Of course. Alright, so if we go one there, and maybe one there, Turn that around and there. Uh, I think that'll do it. Six. All right. Which means we've got to put one there and one there. All right. Now let's see how this. All right. One, two. 
to, okay, yep. Okay, we get these in. And there we go. All right. This was the last one I... No, that was the first one. This was the last one I put in. No, this was the last one I put in. All right. And the reason I was looking for the last one, so we want 24, 23. So, 1, 2, 3... One, two, three, four, five, six. That should be all of them. They sh nope. All right, now we should be able to use the lighting profiles. I want yellow lights. Load from there. And that should have... Yeah. All right. Well, let's get these get this scaffolding out of the way. All right. This is going to get all the scaffolding out. turn my light off that lights this room up pretty well I think with those uh, six lights except this light doesn't look like it was on the profile let's check it, it wasn't which light is this one? Oh, there's a second light 20 all right well let's load it from the profile here and yellow light load from the profile there we go okay all right that looks pretty good okay well i tell you what i'm gonna go get rid of this scrap that i just got and start uh, working on laying out some of the amenities down here and once i get to that point i will give you another update All right, I think I've got all, <clears throat> all my fixtures in place, and uh, I've got uh, some uh, beds in place, some bunk beds, some lockers, uh, some uh, cargo or foot lockers, if you want to call them that, uh, some chairs uh, that uh, they can sit in, and... Uh, now I just need to uh, finish them all up and see how they look. So I think uh, I didn't, you know what, I could put one more in here. Why don't we do that? Let's uh, pull out the uh, bench seating and maybe put that right there like that so as you're coming in one there and one there I think so you're coming in the door here and coming in through like here and then you've got the bench seating and everything that's in place in here so uh yeah so how about uh i get these uh finished and painted and we're probably going to be just about done with the video for the day i think uh with my voice and whatnot the way it's sounding uh we've already got uh, 15 minutes into it so which is not a bad video and for some reason i see my uh frame rates are starting to drop a bit so I'm not sure what that is all about 
Uh, but uh, it's not surprising either uh, with this older laptop. All right, I'll uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit. All right, well, I think I just about got the living quarters pretty much done, uh, at least for now, uh, unless I see something that I want to change on it. So we've got the sleeping quarters. Oh, I said living quarters, sleeping quarters. So I've got uh, kind of uh, more fancy beds up above up here uh, so that uh, maybe your supervisors can have these couple of beds up here and uh, they've got kind of a little private area up here same goes for uh, down below they've got a little corner in here and I couldn't get the lockers in here because I've got this here and uh, a brace for the uh, floor that's up above but They've got lockers there. I put lockers over here on the side for these guys. So uh, that should be plenty fun, good for them. Uh, for the regular crew, we've got uh, bunks here with a locker. And here's uh, a couple of bunks, uh, more lockers. Uh, we've got foot lockers kind of scattered about uh, this side over here. They each kind of get a foot locker. So these would be the new guys that are coming in. Uh, they get to start out here. Uh, a couple of benches for them to sit on <clears throat> uh, to relax a little bit, just uh, to maybe sit and converse. So yeah, here's the uh, sleeping quarters, done. And so here it is coming in. So you'd have the door here and so that kind of, uh, with the uh, washroom on this side, the sleeping quarters on this side, and then we have the living quarters out here. And so the next, next phase is to work on the kitchen, which is going to be over here on this side. And I need to try to figure out what, uh, why my, uh, frame rate started taking a hit uh, I wonder if it has to do with these with this particular mod with the uh, bunk beds and uh, these benches uh, that's Eichsters that I've am using and so I don't know if that is what's causing the frame rates to drop and if it is <clears throat> I'll replace them with something else and kind of take it from there so, yeah, that pretty much wraps up this episode. Uh, if you uh, like the video, please hit that thumbs up. Uh, it really helps the video out a lot. And if you like the channel, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. Uh, all you space engineers out there, keep building away. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.